Let's make some delicious beef belly burn ends. Really tender, really sweet. So this is like pork belly, but this is beef belly, you know. So we're gonna be seasoning up very simply. Salt, pepper, garlic on all sides. Pretty heavy, I mean, it's a pretty thick uh, piece of meat. So if you were to make beef bacon, this is where it comes out of. If you were to cure it, or even just smoke it and slice it, you could just uh, pan fry it. Going to be uh, using the Annex Grill Smoker. We're going to be running it at 275 degrees the whole time. Very simple recipe. We're going to be smoking it for three hours. And also got a drip tray on the bottom for easy cleanup. So three hours later, bark looks really good. So from there, we're just going to slice it up. And there's tons of fat in this, of course. There's a beef belly. But nonetheless, it was really good. So you want to slice it up, you know, some cubes. Then we're going to be adding it to a foil pan along with some brown sugar and some uh, barbecue sauce. I'm using a bourbon barbecue sauce. This was extremely juicy. I did save that other uh, part of it that you see up there. I'm going to be uh, slicing it thin and I will be making some uh, BLT sandwiches. So just like that, cube it up. And to me, almost all the burn end recipes are the same. You know, smoke them at 275, then you wanna cube them, or you can cube them before seasoning them. You know, that way you can season the everywhere, not just the outside like I'm doing here. So once cubed, place them in that foil pan. Uh, there was so much fat, so I did not use any butter, just barbecue sauce and some uh, honey granules. You can use brown sugar. Uh, from here, we're gonna cover it with foil very tightly. We're gonna be placing it back in the smoker to braise for three hours. This is gonna tenderize them even more and they're gonna fall apart really easily in your fingers. This is a bourbon barbecue sauce that I'm using. You can use whatever you like, you can make your own. And from here, probably about two tablespoons or so of honey granules. Uh, once they're braised, you do want to check them at the two hour mark, see how tender they are. If not, leave them for an additional hour. But after that, you want to uncover the uh, foil, remove it, and leave the burn ends uncovered in the smoker for an additional 30 minutes. And this way, uh, the sauce is nice and tacky onto them. So here I'm placing them back in the smoker for those three hours to braise. And after that, I'm gonna remove them, open up that foil, place them back in the smoker. I did toss them a little bit just like that, place them back in. And you do wanna let them rest for about 30 minutes, but these come absolutely fantastic, I'm gonna give them a go.